Hey guys, I'm back. I'm back from uh, school. I haven't been doing much, but I've been busy a lot and uh, got a lot going on right now during summer. And uh, actually, been a good summer now. Nope, I haven't. I haven't been. No, I didn't. I, I didn't get bad grades. I actually got. Actually got. The, the honor roll now today I want to show you guys what I've been doing during the summer so for those of you that are from Marcus that went with me to Marcus Junior High they're going to SK right now um, you guys might might have known what I have been doing because I like art yes that's right I've been doing art and uh, it's actually pretty fun to do it, especially on your own time. So, here's here's what I what I've been doing, which is I've been trying to make my own style of art, which is the hard part. I I've been trying to make my own ab abstracts, but abstracts are kind of kind of hard, kind of hard to paint, but. I always look on the internet on, on some abstracts and I just look at them and then you just got to think about what it looks like, you know, how do you feel about it. Now, I'm going to show you guys some of my drawings I, I, I've been doing and um, during my freshman year in eighth grade, I haven't been drawing much and then I went back to drawing at the beginning of this year of freshman year. Here's how I started out. So yeah, that's me right there. That is called Does Stay Behind. I don't know why I needed that, honestly. Now, I'm gonna show you guys another Dove picture. Now, the reason why I drew doves, because dove ac actually, jo I mean, my name, Jonah, means dove, you know? And, and dove is actually my favorite bird. It's the bird of peace. Peace. Not that peace, but, you know, you know what I mean. Anyways, and I've, I've been trying to do some shadings with some pencil, which I have been doing, which I'm getting better at. But the hard, the hard kind of pencils that would be kind of hard to shade with is colored pencils. That's all a colored pencil right there. Now that was the first time I drew an eye. And I, I drew it the beginning of freshman year, which was the hard part. And um, I'll show you another one. This is the kind of one, this is the kind of um, art that an artist will ask you. Now, what do you see in this picture? How do you feel about it? Pretty cool, huh? Now, I'm gonna ask you guys this question. What do you guys see and how do you feel about it? I'm not gonna take all day for you guys to answer, but. And I'll tell you guys how I started out drawing. I started out drawing animals. The first animal, uh, the first animal that I drew was the elephant, because I like elephants. But I'm all into learning about animals. That's why I'm an animal lover, or should I say, animal freak? That's what I say. Now I've been. I have been drawing a lot of mammals and then I got into insects and amphibians. Like like the butterfly. This one I'm not really done with it yet, but it's a pretty good start. I'm trying to make my own style of it. It kinda looks graffiti, but not not exactly. Now, you all all of you guys seen Free Willy. Now this is the this is this was a challenge for me drawing a killer whale because you gotta see where the fin is at. Because killer whales 
are black. Now, there can be times in art when you can make up your own stuff, like you can make up your own abstract or make up your own animal. Because I made up my own bird. Now, this this bird, if you see the caption, it says the bird of love and beauty. Is that what you see in here? Of course. I've been doing a little bit of graffiti. No, I'm not spray painting the walls. You know, I, I've been doing a graffiti style like this. You can make up your own style on it sometimes. Sometimes you just, sometimes copying is like not good, I would say. But like this, this might look like a dragon style. I did not copy it, but I made it, I made it my own style. This is a J. J for Jonah. If I was a superhero, I'll put I'll put this on my chest. I'm just joking. Now, this is the one that kind of looks like a tattoo. But a lot of kids at school have been asking me, do you want to be a tattooist? And then I just say to them, no. And they're like, then what kind of artist do you want to be? And I just tell them, I don't know. I'm not there yet. But this kind of looks like a tattoo. Doesn't it? You see this butterfly in there with a little bit of the clovers, the sparkles. Those are the kind of ones I, I've been doing. Now, let's go back to pencil shaving. Shaving. Why did I say shaving? Okay, let's go back to pencil shading. Not shaving, shading. I'm going to show you my two best ones. And as you listen to this song, I want you guys to think about, I'm going to ask you this question. How do you guys feel about these two pictures? Like this one. Now, the reason why I drew that one, because family is important. Like family reunions, like they always say, family reunions are all about coming together as a family. Let's go to the next one, the next picture. One that you just seen now was one of my one of my best ones, so that's why I keep it. But that's part of my gallery, and I absolutely love. I've been trying to draw people. That's why I drew that. You can see see on this picture. You can see the beauty in this girl's eye. The beauty in her face. That's why I call this one beautiful. Now, that's my photo gallery, number one. We're going to go on to number two. Peace.